All right, thanks, Blake. A man is wanted by Metro Police, accused of robbing two women at gunpoint during a ride share from Nashville to Nolensville. Peyton Kennedy is live from Lower Broadway with the response from Uber and insight from a personal safety expert. And Nikki, a spokesperson with Uber, told me they're looking into this incident and they are prepared to work with the MNPD. Police are looking for this man, 44-year-old Myron Hughes. We're told he picked up two women in their early 20s from Broadway early Sunday morning. Police say the car, a Kia Forte, and license plate matched Uber's description, but the driver was supposed to be a woman. Police say the man later claimed to be lost, pulled onto a side street, and showed the victims a pistol, demanding they get out of the car and leave all of their belongings behind. A spokesperson with Uber says, quote, the details of this incident are extremely concerning. If information doesn't match up, riders should not get in the car, but instead cancel the trip and report it to us. I spoke with Tom Pattire, a leading personal safety expert, for his advice on staying safe in a ride share. He adds, ask the driver who they're picking up, and if they don't know your name, don't get in. Tom Pattire says he consults with several ride share companies and says they do work to ensure riders are protected. I want you to know that they do everything and anything to keep their passenger base safe. You know, this is not a common situation. It happened. 90 to 95 percent of the time, it will be who it is. You will get there safely. But you have to have caution to the wind and always have a backup plan. He says if things don't go as planned, a weapon is involved and they ask for your belongings, hand them over and save yourself from any potential harm. If you have any information on the suspect in this case, you're asked to call Crime Stoppers. In Nashville, Peyton Kennedy, News 2.